but it's okay because I'm just gonna rant and you guys are gonna have to deal with it. Basic store ever. What is up everybody? Welcome back to my channel. So I was gonna make a video about me spending money at stores I normally don't go into. And then I thought, why cram all of those stores into one video when I can make a series? So I'm going to be starting a series on my channel about stores I don't, buying clothes at stores I normally don't go into. Haven't thought of the title yet, but there will be a series all about this. So today, I will be going into the most basic store ever, Brandy Melville. When I walk past Brandy Melville, I sometimes look inside and I just see these skinny girls. No other size of girls there. Skinny, 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 skinny. As you know, <laughs> I'm not skinny. So I've always been really hesitant to go inside the store because they're really famous for their one size fits all. And if clothes can fit those tiny little girls, how are they going to fit me? That I'm not thin? I don't have that type of body? I got big thighs, I got big hips. Got a big butt. I'm really concerned about the pants. This video might be a flop, but we're gonna try it out anyway. Rules for this series is I have to go into a store that I've never been into. In this case, it's Brandy Melville. I have to go in and buy at least one or two outfits. <sighs> Doesn't seem that hard. But it might be a struggle since it's one size fits all clothing and I don't think anything's gonna fit these thighs. So, <laughs> let's go to Brandy. That was so white. <laughs> Melville. So I go in and I try on just a bunch of things that I see are cute and it was a force of habit for me to look at the sizes of the clothing. They're all the same. So I go into the dressing room, try on the clothing, the skirts would not fit past my thigh. And I was like, this is great. Like off to a fantastic start. I put on a shirt my chest was too big and I don't have a big chest now I know why I don't shop at Brandy Melville number one one size does not fit all does not fit all you don't know how angry I was in that dressing room I have lack of confidence I don't have confidence in my body I don't have I don't think I have a great body so trying on those clothes which are one size fits all Trying them on, I lost confidence that I didn't even have. I didn't want to try any of the rest of my clothes on because nothing would go past my hips. As you see, the skirt doesn't move. It's not going up any further. Brandy could have tons of people shopping there if their sizes weren't one size fits all. I would drop bank at that store. The clothes are absolutely adorable and so trendy, but nothing fits me, so I can't. I really don't know where this rant is going, but I'm heated, so there might not be a point to this rant. But it's okay, because I'm just going to rant and you guys are going to have to deal with it. So when I was in the store, I was walking around, I love to be friendly to people. I love making conversations with people. And I, I apologize when things aren't my fault. It's so like, I'll, I'll go past somebody and I'm like, excuse me, sorry. They're like, oh, you're totally fine. Not in this store. 
I go past someone else, excuse me, let me squeeze right by here. They go, uh-huh. Excuse me? And you work here. She worked at the store. If that was my first time there and stuff fit me and I got not greeted like that, but I got treated like that, there's no way I'm going back to that store. Well, I really wish this episode would have worked out, but it didn't, which is okay because I don't know. It's okay because you got a rant out of it. So in conclusion, one size does not fit all, and I will never be shopping at Brainy Melville again. Thank you guys for watching. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe for more content like this, and I promise the next episode of this series will be a lot better. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!